black or not committed, casted a black magic spell and got what they wanted. They got abundance, wealth. Their whole family was living great. They, everybody they loved got the medical care they needed because of their magic. So, would anybody that's against it would say, "Well, that's demons," and the demons did that. It's like, how come anytime something good happens in the reality, we're pre-programmed to go, "That's demonic and evil." <laughs> anytime something good in the reality happens, we are pre-programmed to go, "That's demonic and evil." Do you guys think we were maybe brainwashed to be that way? Again, I gotta be brutally honest. I don't even think I'd say I'm still waiting for a practical magic spell. Somebody send me a email, a comment. Do it in a comment so everybody can see it. Now I'll even do it in a comment reply. We can all cast your little fucking spell. Give me a practical spell and tell me how to cast it. And I'll go cast it on my next video. As long as it ain't hurt nobody, you know. If it's a just a, just a fuck, give me a fucking one practical spell. Does anybody know a rotten tooth fix spell? I'll take it. Does anybody know a? a Cure your vision spell. There's actually techniques you can do if you go outside and like. Anyways, there, there's ways to actually cure bad vision. Must be going but anyways, uh, a rotten tooth spell. A rotten tooth spell. Fucking hell. All right. So yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sort of already made that point about the bodybuilding. Actually, um. <laughs> look at the rotten teeth there. My goodness. Look at that. Oh fuck. Oh yeah, guys. By the way, I might, uh, depending on how things go, I may be uh, streaming full time soon. So we'll see how things go. Um, I actually already have access to uh, a place where I, I would have um, full reign over whatever I needed to do. Uh, I'm just seeing how things work out, seeing how things go, and uh, I'm gonna make my decision here in probably a couple more weeks. We'll see how things go. Uh, but if they go well. Um, <clears throat> I'll probably be streaming full time. Oh, I've only been doing this one for four months. Oh, yeah, I just resetted the fucking video. What am I thinking? But, uh, yeah, the, uh, what was this video about? <laughs> I totally forgot what this video was about. I get on to rant. Oh, yeah, did, did I make the point about black? It's like, people talking about bad about black. It's like, anytime something works out for somebody, it's bad and evil in this realm. And then we're pre programmed and by the same demon that hates us all the time too. Don't forget that part. Like, remember all this indoctrination still comes from the machine itself. Uh, you know, we're told by them that that shit's evil. And it's like, bro, somebody came up to me and said, yo, Chris, do this. Go, go get a branch off a willow tree and uh, lick the tip, blah, blah, blah. do a couple W's in the air and say, Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory and boom. Somebody's going to donate to your PayPal on YouTube. They're going to donate you a million bucks, 10 million bucks, something crazy. Like, guess what? I'm casting that fucking spell. <laughs> like, I'm going to go. Oh, I bet you would. They're all about the money in this realm. They call it a hell realm and everything else. They want that money. Demons want that money. That's what they want. They show it all the time. They want that PayPal money, Cash App, Patreon, Super Chats, whatever they can get. Whatever they can get from you they want your money Cast that spell. Like, uh, oh i bet i bet they want your money they're gonna donate to your paypal on youtube they're gonna donate you a million bucks 10 million bucks something crazy like guess what i'm casting that fucking spell <laughs> like i'm gonna go cast that spell like uh, and then somebody would say, well, you're being evil. I was like, but, uh, I used a chunk of that 10 million to help my, uh, whatever, get there, whatever. So see, he'll make up something here, whatever, whatever. I'll use a chunk of that money. Bullshit. They're greedy. They try to fool you. They just want that money. They're focused on money. That's what they want. They want money and power in this realm. The same as the billionaires. There's no difference between the lowly demons and the ones at the top of the pyramid. No difference. I to help my, me and my personal. How is it negative? Because it was magic, period. It's like, okay, go back to your pagan holidays and uh, birthday candle rituals. 
Go back to the rituals you're okay with, the ones that actually don't bring you anything because you're wishing for something to come. When you wish for something to come, it's up in the air. If you demand for Hold on a second. I'm going to show the uh, his title for this video. Black Magic Rituals and Other Stuff. That's what he titled this video, all right? Black Magic Rituals. He wishes somebody would perform black magic, uh, fix his teeth, send him $10 million. Look at this. He doesn't under understand after years of running a YouTube channel how to do live streams. He doesn't have a clue. He doesn't have a clue. He thinks he has to go somewhere special and live stream from there. He's, he's just fucked up, man. He's fucked up. Single mom raised. That's what he is. Single mommy raised. For something to come, it comes. <laughs> hey, well, if you're conscious and powerful and strong in belief. What the hell is he drinking there? Did you see that? What the fuck was that? That was nuts. What the hell was that? Look at this creepy creature. Creepy creature. Because it was magic, period. It's like, okay, go back to your pagan uh, holidays and whoosh, whoosh, uh, birthday candle rituals. <laughs> go back to the rituals you're okay with, the ones that actually don't bring you anything because you're wishing for something to come. When you wish for something to come, it's up in the air. If you demand for something to come, it comes. <laughs> hey, well, if you're conscious and powerful. What, what is that there? Let's see there. What's he doing? What's Uncle Fester doing there? Strong in belief. Uh, why would you be the entity second to something else that's powerful asking it to make something better? It's like, well, you just gave all your power away and said you're powerless. So how could you fix your life if you're powerless? No, anyways. Um, yeah, oh yeah, I already talked about that too. Like people that want kids, like. You got a list written down? You got a list of shit? You got a script written down? Is that what it is? innocent freedom assuming they have a nice childhood that could be fucked up too depending on who you're talking to but uh look at this weirdo fuck motherfucker it's it is now happening in our face and you can just hand it can't be what are you talking about does this system see what are you talking about the fucking meat monkeys out there is a little little uh bubble protected comfort zone fake reality we don't want <laughs> but i do have to be brutally honest uh, go ahead what if somebody did a black magic spell whatever the hell that means i don't know is there a difference between black magic and white magic and if there is where are the white magics where are white magic spells i never hear about white magicians i don't see them walking around casting spells healing the blind doing anything where are they at why is it always dark and demonic and evil in this realm? Where's the white magic? Um, and you can say like, well, love is the white magic. Love is another tool used to keep us trapped here. <laughs> like, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but love is actually one of the most powerful. He believes the same thing as Forever Con Man and others, that that's all love is. And Vince Menger, there's a whole bunch of them in the quote soul trap community that think love is just evil. It's evil written backwards, and that's all it is. Not, not just the word word magic. They think that's all it is. That's the level they're at. Look at this creep. Felon. He sold drugs to kids. He robbed people. He assaulted people in his life. And people see him on YouTube, and they follow this. They can't see a deceiver. They can't see an influencer, a manipulator. They can't see it. Even when I show them, they still can't see it. Powerful shackles used by the realm to control us. Uh, 
This isn't news to anybody on my channel. I said this a long time ago. Yeah, love, love is great, isn't it? Yeah, love would say, yes, it would be great if more humans were loving in the realm, but uh, it's actually a sort of drug. In, in a lot of NDEs, the love is a sort of drug used like a carrot. Yeah, we know that. The love bomb. Frequency weapon love. We understand that. Euphoric drug. And that's all it is to you here, it seems like. You're a loveless being. You don't love anyone. At all. You just want money. That's what you want. Money and power over, over others. You're a creep. To lure you into a place like where was the love back home? <laughs> Imagine having a horrible, suffering, miserable human existence and then dying, and then there's something there just waiting to love you. It's like, what the fuck? Why didn't you love the children that were being sacrificed on a daily basis? Uh oh, watch, she's almost gonna cry here. You'll see. Watch this, watch this moment. Why didn't you love the children that were being trafficked on a daily basis down there? Why didn't you love the children that were being tormented or abused or molested on a daily basis down there? We're... <clears throat> uh, we're, we're... Is that bad acting? What do you think that was there? Do you trust this creature on the screen? This character, creature, whatever you want to call it. Look at this thing. Where was your love when the kids were starving? Where was your love when we were struggling? Where was your love when we were going through war? Where was your love when we were going through disease and poverty? More war, war stuff. They try to be very, very vague. Look at this thing. Do you trust this thing? Do you think it gives a shit? Or do you think it wants $10 million uh, donated to its PayPal to put in its bank account? What do you think? What do you think? Come here, boy, I love you, Selma. Come over here into this light. I'm running away from you. You're a demon. And the love is used against me in the end. Don't fall for that bullshit, man. But uh, black magic, black magic. And, and this, it's funny because these same little fucking <clears throat> uppity little uh, dodo birds that will say bad naughtiness about uh, black magic will participate in a pagan holiday every christmas they'll every birth date they'll they'll put a bunch of candles into a, uh, a cake of sweets Not, nothing healthy for you but they'll put a bunch of candles into a piece of food light them on fire carry them they'll all sing a chant and then they'll all make and then the person doing it will make a wish and blow out their candles and everybody will cheer look at the san paku eyes all the way through this here through this whole part Look at this thing. Buddy would cheer at the smoke rises and blah, blah, and it's like, you guys can't tell you're in doing like a ritual or a spell or anything. That's something, how does any of that make sense? Oh, well, it's tradition. Well, it's a ritual tradition. Just because. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye. Take care.